Thanksgiving is the day that we're reminded to be thankful for the things that we've got. Though it may seem like little, sometimes we've always got something to be thankful for. I'd like to tell you a story about a man that I think has a lot to be thankful for. On Thanksgiving Day, a family sat down to have their meal. There was very little on the table, a few things from the field. No turkey, fancy dressing, some bread and a little beans. For the crops had been a failure and the times were pretty lean. The father bowed his head, it was their habit to say grace, and a calmness came over his lined and wrinkled face. Dear Lord, he said, we thank you, for the sun was warm today. And we thank you for the singing of the birds and the laughing of the children as they play. And thank you for that neighbor of mine that fixed my plow. And thank you for that old plow horse. We sure could use a cow. Thank you for the muscle. I can stand the ache. Just let me have your blessing on all I undertake. And I thank you for this country, too. And we've troubles now and pain, but with your help, Lord, we'll get back to where the road is smooth again. And thanks for all the love we've got and the strength to work my land. But there's nothing, Lord, that I can't do if you lend a helping hand. Thank you for my good wife, Lord, and the children that I've got. They love me for the things that I am, and they forget the things I'm not. And if somebody's down and out, Lord, and they're praying you would heed, just send them over to see me, Lord. I got more than I need. Day. I worked so hard, my feet was aching. I never stopped griping about the little bit of money I was making. On my way home, I passed a man, and he was smiling, and he was crippled. Lord, forgive me when a while. The world is mine and I'm doing fine I just want to say I thank you For the food I eat And I thank you, Lord For the place I sleep And I thank you for My coat that keeps me warm 